We are not going to try to use science or evidence. The fact of the matter is that this is a this is opinion. We can we all have our own beliefs as far as when human life begins. Science is not ultimate truth. That's why it's science. It's always being studied. It's always being taught and retaught and rearticulated. So to insinuate that this science is absolute truth on a matter of what is human life is illegitimate. What is inside a body that cannot function outside its host is not a child. It's a matter of reproductive choice. The living, breathing, sentient being that has control over her body is the one that we listen to, not science. Science cannot be applied to my body. I think we're, we're talking about science as if it's, it's something that um, it is absolutely concrete. There is absolute proof that there is, you know, life and there is not life and all this stuff like that. There's, I mean, there's people from this side, from their researchers that say that the heart beats in 21 days. There's people on our side and research that says that the heart doesn't beat until 24 weeks. And so it just, it is completely different. We need to focus on the birth control issue, and that's what you need to be thinking about, rather than any of the photos or scientific evidence that Nate just gave you. I mean, I have a cold, so to say that, I have a virus in my body, and that's, you know, that's also something little and living inside of me, but if, it, if I'm going to try and kill it, I'm not going to be like, oh no, woe is the virus thing, I, mean, I just killed the life, it's not something that... It's not the same thing. Um, anyone who's born with an X and a Y chromosome is biologically female.